Mama. stabbed to death in their house near the campus of the University of Idaho after a night of partying. Law enforcement says the two surviving roommates sleep <laughs> on their first floor <laughs> and didn't wake up until later that morning. Now, at this point, <laughs> police are not sure if the attack was a target on the house or the students. Kaylee's father believes the killer did target his daughter and her friend <laughs> through the second floor sliding glass door. Now, either way, the families are demanding answers. <laughs> As of now, this whole thing remains. <laughs> Casey, let me start with you. <laughs> Beyond <laughs> the horrific nature of this crime, these four young people so tragically killed. Is, is there anything that jumps out at you about it? We have to consider that this is a town that's not had any homicides in seven years. It's a university town, 26,000 students who live there, but half, at least 13,000, are students. Right. So when you think about four people dying one night, <laughs> the horrific slashings, okay, the stabbing of that night, shows a crime scene. Mm -hmm. Whoever went into that house, if it was targeted towards the human, which is what Haley's father believes, started with, uh, in his words, the two girls, but then took the time